What's up guys, Matt from footballboots.co.uk and today we'll be counting down our top 10 best custom boots we've ever created. So check out each edition and vote for your favourite in the poll card in the latter stages of the video. So let's get straight into number 10 and check out our Nike and Recruil Superfly Glitter Boot. Now these were inspired by the silverware CR7s that were actually released. We got the Superfly 5s in the launch colorway Spark Brilliance and all we did was add a little bit of glitter onto the Nike swoosh of this one on that front one and also the medial side as well. Just adds a little bit more of a glamorous and luxurious look to the football boot. But we also did it on the Superfly 4s as well. And what we did on this one, this was much more like this CR7 silverwares. It's got that glitter effect all across the upper, not on the Nike swoosh, we kept that clean. But either side of the upper, it's got that glitter effect and it does look pretty unique. We actually did this on fake football boots, so don't worry about us ruining the real expensive pairs. These were just fake ones. And also, the silverware actually football boots did come off a little bit. When you played with them, we received them in the office. And when we took them down the pitch to do a little bit of a test, some of that glitter actually came off. And that's the same effect that you'll find on our custom pairs as well. The glitter, when you do strike the ball, will do some keepy uppies. It does wear off a little bit. We can see it on my fingers already. So these are definitely made for the mantle piece and not for the actual football pitch. But there are number 10 custom, the Glitter Superflies by Nike. So that was our 10th best custom, but in at number nine, we've got our black and white Evo Power Vigors, which were inspired by Juventus and Newcastle United's football kit being black and white stripes. And I think compared to the actual original camo design, these get a big thumbs up for the better version because that first original camo were a little bit questionable and you can't really go wrong with a black and white boot. And this has got some silver detailing and you can't really go wrong. But let's explain a little bit more about how we actually did this specific custom. Now, for you regular watchers of our channel, you know we do a lot of blackouts and the synthetic on a football boot actually takes to the blackout really well. But one problem about Puma's Griptex upper is that it didn't actually let the dye soak into it that well. Usually on maybe like a Mercurial Vapor, it only really takes one coat. But on this Griptex Puma boot, it actually took two or three coats to actually make black. It was pretty difficult. We can just see if I bring it in close that it's almost got a little bit of a blue toe to it. But overall, I think it's pretty sharp looking boot. And of course, I'm a new Newcastle United fan so these were kind of a boot for me inspired by Newcastle United's kit or if you're an Italian maybe Juventus but overall I think this is a really sharp looking boot and that comes in at number nine. So in at number eight is a very special pair of football boots created by BR Customs. If you haven't seen him on Instagram, make sure to check him out. Link's in the description below. Make sure to go into his Instagram because he's created some lovely looking football boots. And these, of course, are inspired by us at footballboots.co.uk, the black and orange team. And these will always be one of our favorite customs ever created. So as said, BR Customs actually did these for us. And what he actually had to do was go onto Nike ID and create an entirely white mercurial as the base coat to create this black and orange colorway. And there's no doubt it looks incredibly sharp. What he's done on the right boot, he's gone with black at the front, orange at the back with a Nike swoosh in orange as well. But then on the left boot, he's gone for orange at the front, black at the back and the black Nike swoosh. So they almost kind of contrast each other. So they're not actually the same. They're a little bit opposing, but overall the look is fantastic. We've obviously got the Football Boots logo on that medial side panel. I think these are really sweet. If you see a lot of our videos, especially what the ones with the TV in the background, you'll see one of these boots kind of lying on top of it or maybe beside it. It's because they're one of our favorites and it obviously goes with the football in the background pretty nicely. And that's our eighth best custom and thank you to be our customs for this. So let's put these orange and black football boots aside and moving on to number seven, we've got our Stella Pack Superfly Fives. Lovely, lovely looking football boot and we actually took inspiration from the Footy Boot Addicts who did an Opus and Vapor in the similar kind of inspiration, taking it from Adidas's Stella Pack range and giving it onto a Nike football boot. So thank you to Footy Boot Addict for letting us kind of copy him and make sure to check out his Instagram as well in the description below, leave his links there. There's no doubt that these football boots look incredibly luxurious and let's explain a little bit more about how we actually created this specific design. So this is actually the opposite boot to the Spark Brilliant Superfly that we gave those sparkling swooshes to, but we put one aside and saved it for this Stella Pack creation. And as we can see, it's got that white base coat, but it wasn't actually our usual type of spray paint. Instead, it was an enamel, which is a little bit thicker and stiffer. But one problem that we actually found is because it maybe was so kind of thick and stiff that it actually started to crack pretty quickly around that medial side where you flex your foot and also around the toe box. So these are definitely made for the mantelpiece. But alongside that white 
that enamel, we gave it a gold Nike swoosh there and also one on the medial side and it had that black border and one of the standout features of it was that all over gold sole plate which always looks stunning, there's no doubt about it and that is our number 7 best custom so far. So on to number six, and this is much more of a recent custom that we actually did, the Hyven and Phantom 3DF, and it was actually inspired by another Adidas collection, this time around the Blue Blast pack, and this is the final variation of it. So we actually did three customs for this Blue Blast Hyven and Phantom 3. It started on the launch colorway, which was green and orange. First one we did was black and orange to make it like football boots, just like the one that BR Custom did. They look pretty slick. From there, we moved on to a black and pink one, pretty good again and this was the final outcome it's a little bit sloppy because the spray paint we used was called glow coat and it was actually a bit more dusty so you can almost see it on my fingers it kind of comes off a little bit to give it a bit of a kind of a sloppy look so if nike actually created this one for real there's no doubt it'll be an absolute smash especially because the launch colorway was a little bit questionable but we do love this and make sure if you haven't watched the actual custom video of these to see the other two variations make sure to go onto our channel and check them out and that comes in at number six our blue blast Hyvern and Phantom 3DF. So we get to our halfway stage and in at number five is our Checker Black Messi Pure Agilities. And the reason we actually created this specific boot was because Adidas didn't give their Pure Agility the same colorway in the Checker Black collection. They actually left this boot absent from that specific pack, which is a bit of a shame because this boot actually here that we created doesn't look too bad. So if Adidas actually did them themselves, there's no doubt it would have looked really sharp with the all over black base coat. But we gave it that gradient effect on the bottom, going from that black into the original blue color at the back and it looks really nice and we gave it some metallic detailing for that messy logo on the medial side and also the adidas three stripes now what we actually used for that messy logo was the nail varnish so it wasn't the first time that we used nail varnish it was the second time and we're going to show you exactly how we did that nail varnish in another one coming up i think it's in at number three so this is number five our checker black messy pure agilities really lovely looking boot let's move on to number four we've already seen the blue blast hive and phantom 3ds but this is our blue blast glitch boots and they look absolutely stunning there's no doubt about it and if you haven't watched this custom as well make sure to go on go onto our channel and actually watch that one too because it was two variations as well just like on the hyper venom this was our favorite out of the bunch and we can see it's got that blue base coat across the front of the boot transform it into pink at the black and i wish adidas would have actually handed a blue blast pack that colorway onto the glitch because the glitch wasn't included but i think it looks absolutely stunning especially on that sole plate it started to flake away a little bit but from that blue into pink, I think it's absolutely stunning. There's no doubt about it. Added that three stripes in white. I think this is absolutely stunning. There's been a few colorways for the glitch so far, but I think if this was actually a colorway that Adidas released, there'd be a smash. There's no doubt about it. So that was our fourth best custom. We gave you a hint into what was coming. This is number three, and this is our Red Hyphen and Phantom 2. And these were so hard to achieve. It took me about three, four days to actually create this custom, but there's no doubt it was definitely worth it. It was actually the only Hyper Venom colorway to come in red. We were waiting for it for so long that we couldn't wait any longer. So we decided to do our own one. We gave it a gradient effect from red into black, but there's also some silver detailing. And as mentioned, this was actually created by using nail varnish. So this was actually the first time that we used nail varnish to help us with a custom creation. It sounds a little bit strange to use nail varnish, but it helped us so much. What we did, we used it to create the shadow effect graphic in that zigzag design of the Hyphen and Phantom 2. So what we did was we gave it a black base coat and then we added just little dots of the nail varnish on top, that metallic silver colorway. And then to create that more sharp looking football boot, that specific design, we went around it with a black Sharpie. And as we can see, if I bring it in closer, it does look incredibly sharp. There's no doubt about it. Very hard to achieve it took a long time but definitely worthwhile these were actually the lightning storm hypervenom so that green colorway we can just see it where the spray paint has started to crack that was the original base coat so that just shows how much of a task it was to make it red and black from that green colorway but that is a pretty good attempt and that was our number three best custom of all time so guys, we get into our number two best custom of all time, and these were an absolute hit with you guys. They're the rare gold Superfly 5s inspired by MQ Customs. Again, all these details are in the description below, so make sure to check them out, because he's done some nice customs. He's also got a decent YouTube channel too. But what we had was a blackout pair of the Superfly 5s, and we gave them a gold gradient. They look incredible, and of course take inspiration 
from the rare gold CR7 football boots and they look beautiful in that gold gradient into black around the side and onto the heel cut and we also gave that CR7 branding a glittering effect in more gold and of course their standout feature is that sole plate complements the overall visual and I think these are an absolute standout boot and one of our favourites and one of our favourites of all time at the Football Boots channel. So here it is guys, our best custom of all time and you guys went absolutely crazy for these and these are my very own take on the Pogboom Pure Controls by Adidas and as we can see it's all about a black base coat with some gold additional touches, we've got some gold Adidas 3 stripes, a gold Adidas logo, we even did the details of the Ace logo on the medial side of the boot and of course that sole plate again just like the rare golds looks stunning with that gold gradient into black and you can just see that boost technology still which we had to tape up to give it a very sharp and crisp look but they are absolutely gorgeous we even gave it a pog boom detailing on the back let us know how you think we did this in, in the comment section below we'd like to know how you think we actually achieved this look but they look stunning there's no doubt about it but there it is guys our top 10 customs of all time there's no doubt there's some stunning ones especially the top three but all of them to be fair are all decent especially our br customs special ones so let us know in the poll call which ones your favorites are and also in the comment section below what ones your favorite and why and also what custom we should do next thanks for watching guys cheers